What is good about this money? Let me tell you, this money can never be good until you pay me your two months house rent. Okay? But sir, I, I thought we talked about this. And I promised I will make the payment next week. Why, why are you still talking about it? I've changed my mind because I don't trust you. I've changed my mind. I don't trust you. Nay, please take it easy on him. Eh? He said next week. Why can't you excise patients till then? If he did not pay, you can do whatever you want. Eh? Allow the poor boy to rest for once. Just yeah. heard him. He said next week. Hey, 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 allow hey, hey, this poor boy to rest. If I hear him from you now, I should allow him. Do you see this man someone that can keep to his promises? If you know that he doesn't have money to pay for his house, why, why, why must you occupy two rooms? Look at this one. Always locked. I don't know if he's afraid of it. This one. He also occupied this one. Huh? Is he mad? Why are you back in here? You pay me only for one month. With the stories that uh, you don't have money, you came from a, 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 a poor family and they allowed you. Since then till now, from one story or, 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 or to the other. But sir, uh, we, we talked about it. I, I told you, you should give me one week. I'll make I'll make up the money and I'll give it to you next week. That's what I told you. And you agreed. We had an agreement. And now you're coming to scream at me that, that you don't trust me. How can you say you don't trust me? I am screaming in my own house. Because I gave you a house. Now I am screaming because I'm demanding for my house. Sir, I didn't say you, but we had an agreement before. We had an agreement. And I said I don't trust you again. I have changed my mind. Uno, come on. Please, give him this last chance. Hmm? I am sure he's going to do something. Two months rent is not too much for a young boy like this to run around and pay. Allow him to rest. Be cool. Listen to me. Listen to me, all of you. Maggie, 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 listen to me. If you like, do something. If you like, do whatever that pleases you. But. Two but, but if I never did that, my comment. For a young I am going for a meeting. By the time I come back, then I'll have your time. Hey! Thank, thank, thank you, man. I, I, I promise you to pay next, next, next week. Just try. Hmm? Try your best, eh? Sorry, sorry. What, what kind of woman do you expect? Eh? Sorry. Hey, no, the man here. Oh yeah, do what you're doing, huh? Hey, no, the man. Papa, I, I would like to talk to you. You would like to talk to me? About what? Yes, Papa. Um, it's... <clears throat> it's about Odili. Odili? Has he given you my money? Umbao, Papa, just relax. He hasn't given me the money. It's even because of the money I want to talk to you. <sighs> um, Papa. See, eh? The way you are harassing this young man over this rent is not good. It's not good. It's not good because it could be your son. Because of ordinary two months rent. Eh? That this young man is owing you, you are harassing him like this. Ah! You have a son like him. Why can't you just assume that he's your son? I mean, Papa, think about it. Supposing he's your son and someone else is harassing him over ordinary two months' rent. How will you feel? Eh? Nobody knows tomorrow and no condition is permanent. And in this life, whatever we do, we have to think of the future. We have to think of tomorrow. Because anybody can become anything at any time. Papa, think about it, though. Think about it. So... This is the reason you stopped me. Yeah. Just... This is the reason you stopped me. Do you know you are a fool? Huh. A big fool. Now you listen to me. My son, Samson, can never be in that condition because he is a husband. Mm -hmm. And then 
not so tell you. If you are all the less lawyer speaking on his behalf, Bow. you better go and tell him that I don't want to hear his story again by next week, which is four days today. If you don't pay me my money, if you don't pay me my money, what I will do to him, he will regret ever stepping his feet into this compound. Come on, get the side. Get this side. Get this side. Papa, no. Why is Papa, just relax now. Nobody gets tomorrow, Papa. Can I can never do Okay, do like. Hey. Judith, yeah, Judith. Where is your sister? She's in front of the house. Uh -uh. Has she prepared the, uh, the breakfast? Mama, I don't know. In fact, it's like she's not happy this morning. What is wrong with her? Um, I don't know. Hey. Mama. Mama, you have to talk to Papa. You have to talk to Papa. Talk to your husband. Hey, after all, is your husband now. You have to talk to him. This is not nice. What is fair is fair. And this is totally not fair. Hey. Um, what did he do? It's about Odili. Odili, hey. our tenant. You were here this morning now. This is what happened. Is this how to behave? Is this how to treat people? Eh? I went to see if I could talk to him, for him to calm down. But instead, he continued from where he stopped. He didn't even listen to me. It's not nice now. How can he be harassing this young woman like this? Over an ordinary two months of rent. Haba! No condition is permanent, though. Hmm. But is that why your face is like this? Is that what makes you so upset? Eh? Uh -huh. By the way, what is your interest? In this matter, hey. why are you so concerned? Eh, hey. why, why, why won't I be upset? Eh, hey. why won't I be concerned? Am I not a human being? Mm -hmm. Are we not all human beings? Is it not a human being, too? Eh, hey. I, I should be concerned for my fellow human being now. What is that? Is this how to treat people? Eh, hey. is this how to treat people? It's not good, Mama. Stop talking like this. You know what I'm saying. What is good is good. What is not good is not good. This is a young man just like your son. You too, you have a son, mama. You have a son just like this. Can't you just assume this is your son and treat him right? You think he chooses to be poor? You think if he has a choice, he will come here and, uh, and he, will, he will come here and uh, come to this village and, and be a poor man? Of course not. He doesn't have a choice. Circumstances of life and situations and family background has brought him here not for us to treat him as a slave. The least we can do for him is to be nice and kind to him. It won't cost anything. Let's be nice and let's show love. Your son, Samson, he's also in the in the city. He's a tenant in the city, and I'm sure his landlord does not treat him like this. Because brother Samson pays his whole house rent very well. What is it? Uh -huh. What is it? Uh, wait. Uh. Who just spoke? I don't understand. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> hey, I have suffered. Hey. <clears throat> Bia mama. Mama! Please. I don't want to be upset. Want this daughter of yours never to interfere when I'm talking. Don't you dare interrupt me next time because if you do, you will never believe what I will do to you. Are you mad? Who's your mate? Oh no, 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 you two, you have an opinion. You want to have an opinion in my mouth. I'm talking, you are talking. Judith, uh -huh. I thought you've done washing the plate. Oh, you are busy listening to us. Master Queen, parrot. Eh? Odobunwai, Ibuonan. Hey! You know what I'm saying? And what did I do now? Uh -huh. What did I do now? I just told her the truth. What did I do now? The truth. Oh yeah, come on, continue washing. Mama, I will now watch the plate. Uh -huh. But you have to tell this good Samaritan of your daughter. Look what Mama is yeah. still talking. Look at this. You have to tell this good Samaritan of your daughter to leave Papa. Are you serious? Oh, so you, ma okay, so you, you have to end it, Mama. You Mama. have to end it. Uh -huh. Mama, what? Your father is not around, so you have to be guided. Be mindful of the things you say, because I will slap you, and nothing will happen. Look at her. I'm now I'm Silly girl, talkative. You two have an opinion. I'm talking. You are talking. I don't blame you now. Papa has spoiled this girl now. Papa has spoiled her. Let me, let me, let me arrange her. Let me just arrange her right now. Let me repair you. Are you mad? Please leave her. No respect. Hmm. Look at her. You two, you want to have an opinion. I'm talking, you are talking. No respect. 
Oh, you can no go on. Retaliate. Beat her back. Mama, I didn't do anything. You were running to talk to talk to talk to talk to talk to talk See, respect yourself. It's not everything you hear, you talk. What did you tell? I bought a bag. Oh, he, he, oh, bag. Give me this. Oh, yeah, wash this plate. Wash it, your sister. Man, who pia go go? Oh, 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 Hey, I'm a meter girl now. Judith. How was your trip to Abuja and how is your son doing? Um, Your Majesty, my trip to Abuja was very, very fine and successful. Um, <clears throat> I came back just yesterday afternoon, you know, and um, as for my son, he was very fine when I left him at Abuja. That's good. That's good. Anyway, um, Your Majesty, so how was the marriage ceremony of our prince? You know, I was to accompany you for that ceremony. But because of the exigency of things in my family, I had to travel to Abuja. Uh, so as I'm back, I felt it wise to come and ask you how far the ceremony went. And... Um, how is our future law? It's your former. The marriage did not work out again. Why? My son refused to marry her again. He said that uh, he cannot marry a girl that does not have a respect or regard to anyone just because she feels that uh, she's a princess and she comes from a royal family. Just like that? Just like that, it's your former. And then, uh, I saw reasons in what he was saying. He said that the girl is arrogant. That we could not control her. And if you look at it from what he has seen himself, I will not force him to marry a lady that cannot live comfortably with him. Just because uh, she feels that she is a princess and uh, uh, the future queen of this kingdom. As we cannot control her, it can only cause immunity between me and her father's family. That's all. Your Majesty, I think your decision is wise. You know, in issues of uh, marriages, it's always good for the people concerned to make their choices. You know. But, uh, guys of nowadays, I don't know what's wrong with them. Just because they are in classy positions, they just misbehave. Anyway, uh, Your Majesty, so what of my prince? I would like to see him. Immediately after that incident, he went back to London. He said he wanted to go and rest and forget about all that happened. Though he instructed us to continue to look for a good woman that he will get married to as soon as he comes back. Well, Your Majesty, if you ask me, that was a very good decision he made. You know, as for getting a good woman, we will have to look around. I'm sure we are going to find a nice one that will fit perfectly into the royal family. You know? <laughs> but your majesty, if I may ask, um, are you granting me the permission to bring any girl I deem fit for that particular position, you know, to bring her to the palace for you to assess. Sure. Is she? Very, very sure. As long as she is a nice and good woman. Ah, Your Majesty, you know me. That is my area of specialization. <laughs> I've done that several in the past. So, I will look around and uh, certainly I will give you adequate feedback. Hmm? Uh, but I would like to take my leave now. And please do give my regards to my lord. Thank you, my Thank you.
more for the video. Go ahead, go ahead. Thank you very much. Oh, Mamuche. No. Mamuche. Huh? Are you going out? Yeah, so. Okay. Huh? I'm done working at your farm. You did? You finished clearing that I plan? I cleared everywhere. Hey! I'm going to I cleared everywhere. You're very strong boy. Mamuche, the truth is, I need the money urgently. That's why yeah. I have to do the work very fast. Hey. The money? Uh, I'm going to I cleared everything. You go there, everything is completely cleared. Uh, you start. I hold this one. Huh? You don't go there, okay? Eh? Hi! Mamuche. Uh, well. uh, this is not the agreed amount now. We uh, agreed 5,000. Uh, uh, and this is 3,000. I remember VJD. See, hold this one. Eh? I'll go and survive the land. I'll go and check if you've worked it, you know, cleared very properly. Mm -hmm. eh, I'll go and do what check. What are you talking about? We had an agreement. Eh, you don't come, no, no. Mama, 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 don't, don't do this now. Hey, eh? Mama, do, 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 you, you, don't you know how big that farm is? Hey. I, I told you I, I needed the money all urgently. Okay, my son. If you don't want this one, give it to me. Eh? Mama, Mama, tell me, please. Tell, tell me, when am I coming to get the balance? What, 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 what nonsense is this? You saw me working in that farm. You know how big that farm is. I've been working since how many days now? And now you you, you, you don't want to pay me my complete money. Yeah. Don't worry, I'll go and survive it next tomorrow. After survive it, let's go now. Mamuche, I said I've cleared the farm. Let us go now, you see it. I'll spend your money. Let me go and take it. You said, me, well, I have your phone. Mamuche! I'm a Mamuche, bring that to Baba. Oh, my son, how are you? How is London? We are fine here. Yes, your mother is fine too. Mm -hmm. Yes. Your sister? No, she has not come back. I spoke with her a few days ago, but she said uh, she will soon be back home. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. No, 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 no. Not at all. Yes, I would like her to serve in this state. Not? That cannot be. I will not allow her to serve in the north. Oh. <laughs> the woman you will marry. I am still searching. The moment I found one, I will let you know. That's my son. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you very much. Bye. Ah. He is in a high expectation. Mm. Adelie, what's wrong? What's wrong with you? What happened? I don't know why people are so wicked and heartless. I don't know. <sighs> Tell me, what happened? Some people just find pleasure in making other people feel bad. You remember that woman I told you? The woman I told you wanted me to clear her farm. Oh yeah, the one that said you were going to clear the farm for this year's cultivation. Yes. So what about her? I cleared the entire farm. Okay. And? This woman has refused to pay me my complete money. Oh no. After working so hard, after suffering for her, I cleared the entire bush for that little money I charged her and she couldn't even give me the money. After suffering for this woman, after clearing the entire bush, she asked me to come back a day after tomorrow. How much is the money? It's okay. It's okay. Please. 
Odilene, calm down. I understand how you feel. I know this 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 really hurts. <sighs> but just relax, okay? This is not the end of the world. I mean, it's not the worst thing that can happen to you or that has happened to I you. I told your father I'll give him the rent money. I know. And I expected this woman to pay me my complete money so I can pay your father. I know. I know. Just relax. And now I won't be able to do that because she has disappointed me. Um, okay, I, I am going to think of something, okay? I, I will do something about that. I don't need you to worry, okay? I will handle this. But first, you need to cheer up. Cheer up? Is this the reason your face is as though the worst has happened? This is not that serious. Relax, I will handle this, Okay? Okay, so, what do you have in this bag? Hmm? I stopped over at the market mm -hmm. to get some things for okra soup. Okay. So? I, I don't like making promises. Oh. I don't like making promises and not keeping to my words. Again. Your father is going to think I'm not a serious human being. <sighs> but your father is going to think I'm not responsible. Odili, calm down. I know. That's why I'm here. I'll take care of this. Okay? Cheer up. Can we go cook now? Oh. Most of this okra, most of them are old, like very strong. Good afternoon, sir. Welcome, Papa. They are elderly. Sir. I hope you do not use my money for uh, use the money for my house rent. To buy all this ice fish, to prepare this nonsense soup. Huh? No, no, sir. Now nah, you listen to me. If by tomorrow you don't pay me my house rent, you will say on that side of me. I don't want any story. Tomorrow, I don't want any story. If you don't pay me my house rent by tomorrow, you will say on that side of me. Ha, huh, Papa. Is, is, is it food that somebody wants to eat that you're calling, calling rubbish? Uh -huh. How is this rubbish? Is it not close to? Who is this one talking? Huh? Who is this one talking? I am talking and they are talking back at me. Okay? Come here, you brother. Obon, obon. You're a lady. Yeah, what you? What are you doing here? Uh, I'm, I'm helping him to cook the okra now. You came to do what? To cook. I say what? You came to help her cook soup, okra soup. I say cook. Huh? Oh, yeah? Ah. You say, Pa, you came to help her cook. I say cook. Now, nah, get out of this place. I say get out. Are you still here? Because never. Yeah, this boy. I can find your leg. She's just helping me cook. She's just helping you cook. As a husband and wife. Any you wife. Help helping you cook. As a husband and wife. Yeah. Yeah. Orderly. 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 It's okay. Don't worry. By tomorrow. Just. It's alright. Listen. If by tomorrow you don't pay me my money, if by tomorrow you don't pay me my money, you will say on that side of me. We shall see. Yeah, only that. Only that. Only that. Do you want me to die just like that? I will rock with a man who knew. Why, why, why? I called you in the presence of your mother here to tell us 
the meaning of that thing I saw you being out there with your delay. Hmm. Papa, I don't understand what you're talking about. See, don't even pretend as if you don't know what I'm talking about. What is that thing I was doing with Odili? Honestly, me, I don't understand you. I don't know what you're talking about, Papa. What was it I was doing? Eh. Hey. Hey. Eh. Woman, talk to your daughter before I lose it. Talk to your daughter before I lose it. Huh. Ma. It's about the cooking of soup you and Odele was doing today. That's all. That is it. As simple as that. Just because I was cooking soup with Odili or okay. cooking soup for Odili is not an offense. How is that supposed to be a crime? What is the big deal in me helping a fellow human being to cook soup? Helping Odili to cook as in what? As your husband or what? Papa, so it's only my husband I can help to cook in this life. Somebody has to be my husband for me to show to, to show love and, and, and cook. Something as simple as cooking. Papa Biko, I know you have your differences with Odili. I know of the existing problems. But please do not bring me into your rent fight with Odili. I agree you brought him into this company as your tenant. But don't mix me up in the, in the fight. Ah, ah. Please, I'm not enemies with him because he's owing you. I can always help him eh, however, however I can, in any little way I can. Did you hear your daughter? Is it not clear to you now that both of them have something in common? Hey! Ha, Papa! So you're suggesting that me and Odili have something in common? Oh, okay. What is that thing that I will possibly have in common with Odili? What is that thing? You're asking me. You're asking me. Because I Now you listen to me. Listen to me. Pray that my suspicion doesn't come to you. Else, I will cut off your head. Woman, hey. talk to your daughter. Talk to your daughter. Ah, nah, it hasn't gotten to that now. Eh? Yeah. Hey. Oh. Oh, Nine. Mama. Oh, Nine, Chuku. Mama. Oh. <laughs> what your father is saying is true. Mm. Before, Uncle. I'm not saying that both of you are doing anything. Yes. You have to be very careful of your closeness with Odile. Oh, Odima. Remember, Odile is a man. Mm. And he has blood running in his vein. Mm -hmm. I don't want any stories tomorrow. You know your father. What he's saying is not a threat. But be careful. I've heard you. Oh, Mama. How many times have I called you? Ten times. Be very, very careful. Oh. All this warning. <sighs> all this ganging up and, and meeting. Just because I cooked for a fellow human being. Mama, please, I've not done anything wrong here for all of you to be warning me up and down. Papa is warning you to your warning. What is it? I've not done anything wrong. My hands are clean. My mm -hmm. conscience is clear. Yes. There's nothing wrong in me. Cooking for Odili. Yes. Oh. Your legs are clean. Your head are clean. So you want us to wait until you have anything to do with him before we warn you. Mama, but let me ask you a question. What is that thing that I will possibly have to do with him? Because I me, don't I don't know. know. No, you should know now. You should know. Because me too, I don't know. Oh. He's coming. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Does no sir. Did you come with my money? Ah. Uh -uh. I answer your greetings first. The only greetings I want to hear from him now is my money. Good money. Money. Ha. Ah. Hmm. Oh. 
sir. Take. How much is there? Sir? I said, how much is that? Is that is someone, huh? Sir, it's 4,000. For it? 4,000. 4, 4, for the rent. But I told you that you must complete the money for 30 months. And this today, this month is almost 28. 10 days to end. And you are giving me 4,000 dollars. My friend complete my money, 30 months. Nay. Collect the one he has given to you now. And give him some time. Why must I collect this one? I told him this before now. You see, you see why I was telling you that I can't want this boy. That he can never fulfill his promises. Have you seen it now? Instead of three months, he's giving me two months. How do I complete my money? Huh. Um, Adele, give me the money. Give it to me. Give me. Go. Go. I say go. Yeah. Why did you collect that money from him? My, because I need to buy foodstuffs for this house. And um, I have the right to collect house rent. Yeah? Would you have, make sure you don't remove one naira from that money. Uh -uh. Make sure you don't remove one naira from that money. How can I remove one naira from it? Eh? What can I do with one naira? Eh? I said I want to buy foodstuffs. And this one can buy something for me. Can I have the money? Uh -uh. Which money? The one you collected from all the now. Say which money? I'll give you one. No. Hey, you it's not possible. I want to buy food stores. Ujiak. Mm. Ujiak. Don't remove money from any any money from that money. I'm warning you. Yes. So, what is your name and uh, who are your parents? Ichi, yes. I hope there's no problem. No, no, there's no problem at all. Um, ah. I, yes. Okay, my name is Amara, the daughter of Agnes. Late Mazin Jemanzi's wife. Late Mazin Jemanzi. Jemanzi. Ah, that name rings a bell. Ah! Your father was in Jemanzi, the man that fell from top of the pantry two years ago and died. Mm. Ah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah. So, uh, how is your mother? She's fine. Good. It's okay. Please, you will help me tell your mother hmm, that I would like to come and see both of you in the evening. Yeah, no, there's no problem. Umbano, there's no problem at all. I'm coming to see you for a very good reason. Okay. Hmm? All right. All right. Send me word to her. Huh? Okay. What are you saying? Why are you here? Just ask my name and who my parents are. Ah. I told him he said he would come and see us later this evening. What for? I wouldn't know until he comes. Anyway, you know he has a son in Abba. Maybe he wants his son to marry him. God forbid. Chukwaju. Yeah. No way now. He is below my class. He's not up to standards. Is that possible? Am I which class are you talking about? I mean, I don't know the class. Is this not you? <laughs> you are welcome once more. Thank you, Isabel Wine. <laughs> My daughter gave me your message that you were coming to see us. I hope there is no problem. Because I can't remember the last time you visited since uh, my husband died. Agnes, there is no problem at all. In fact, I came here for very good reason. Yeah. Yes, and uh, it's something very good. Thank God you said uh, it's something very good. Yes. You're welcome. Thank you. 
Uh, before I proceed, where is your daughter? Because uh, the reason I'm here has something to do with your daughter. Yeah. Yes. My daughter is inside. Ah, come here. Amara Amara! Mama! Please come. Welcome. How are you? Um, now that your daughter is here, I will go straight to the reason I'm here. Yeah. Yes. Um, I want to ask you a question, Agnes. How will you feel if you become the in-law to our Igwe? Hey, because you be a boy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'll be very happy. I know. Amara, how will you feel if you are referred to as the future law of this kingdom? That is the wife of the prince. <laughs> it's a, trust me, you want to know. <laughs> hey, a former. You see, the Igwe sent me a message. You see, the prince of this kingdom, our prince, is in London as we speak. Before he left, he gave an instruction for the Igwe to look for a very nice girl, a homely girl, well brought up. Uh, to be groomed until he comes back so that uh, he can marry her as a wife. And um, you know, I'm very close to the Igwe. He's my personal friend. So the Igwe gave me the job to look for that particular girl. So that is why I am here to see you. Ichi. All this you just said, how does it concern my family? <laughs> now let me tell you how it concerns your family. Amara here growing up, you know, I've been watching her. I saw the way you brought her up. And particularly after the death of the father two years ago, I noticed that you were able to handle her properly and she's now a grown-up girl, very beautiful and um, good-mannered. And that is why I've chosen her to be the wife of our prince. God will bless you for remembering my poor family. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for choosing me. I've seen the beauty in me. Thank you. Oh, yes. <laughs> hey. 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 For doing this for my poor family, hmm? Hmm. whatever you ask for, whatever you ask for from me, eh? I will do it. Mm. Yes. Whatever I ask for, Anything I ask for, you will do. Ask for anything, I will do it. <laughs> to start, let me have a cup of water. <laughs> that one is a very small thing. Get him water to drink. You're welcome once more. You said whatever I ask for. Anything I ask for, you will give me. <laughs> <laughs> Iche, uh, that's a small thing. Really? <laughs> Oh, oh, <laughs> I can handle it. You, you see, you know, nothing goes for nothing. Mm -hmm. You understand that? Yes. And from your response, I can see that you're very smart. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <clears throat> hey. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We are one in this life. Just like that, I wear a 
Why do you look so confused? Now, this assignment they give us without giving, teaching us any civil tip from the textbook. They didn't teach you all the things they know in your head. They didn't. Uh, let me see. Here. Yeah. This one looks very complicated. Um. Why? Why don't you tell um need to help you do it? Yeah. What the leg what? What does he even know? Did you finish primary school? Pick your voice. Did you even finish primary school talk more of going to the secondary school gates? Oh, hold on. Take your book and fix it yourself. Oh, oh no. You don't know the person that knows you will not make the person teach you. See, do you remember that my assignment I had 49 over 50? Mm -hmm. It was Odili that helped me. Uh-uh. Mm. Are you serious? Don't touch me. How come now? How come now? Because he knows. Even like that, I cannot even stoop too low to ask him to do my son. Let me fail. It's okay. Happy failing. Enjoy. Enjoy your failure. What am I even still sitting here doing? We are one in this life. We are all home. Stop looking at me. Do you want me to die just like that? What is it? What do you mean? What bothers you? I have a lot of things on my head right now. I have so much bothering me. Things like what? Is it my father's room? I need some money to take care of some things. Take care of things like what again? Listen, your father's rent is not the only problem I have. I have other problems I need to sort out. Your former, Your Majesty, you're welcome. Thank you, Your Majesty. Who is the elegant looking, beautiful lady beside you? <laughs> your Majesty, I will go straight to the reason we are here. If you recall, there was a time we discussed about the woman that our prince will marry after the first incident yes. and uh, you granted me the permission to look for a nice maiden in our kingdom who has all the qualities required for you know the wife of our prince as a royal yeah and um, the whole idea is for him to marry her when he returns from London. Can you remember? Yes, yes, I do. I do remember. For any good news? Your Majesty, you can trust me. Here is Amara. She's from this kingdom. Um, she's well-mannered, well-brought up, from a very good home. I did my homework, I did due diligence, you know. So she has all the qualities that is needed, you know, to be the wife of our prince. That's right. That's um, right. As you can see, she's ravishingly beautiful, don't you think? Absolutely. <laughs> it's your former. Your Majesty. Once again, you are welcome. Thank you, my Even you, you, you are on the right path. Yes. Young lady, who are your parents? My name. I am the daughter of Agnes, late Mazin Jemanzi's wife. In German, sir. In German, sir. 
Uh, Your Majesty. Nazi Jemanze was that pan wine tapper who fell from top of the palm tree about two years ago and died. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Now I remember. Now I remember. Um, young lady, you heard what uh, the chief of farmer said. Are you prepared to get married to my son, the prince of this kingdom, when he returns from London? Yes, my king. I am very, very prepared. As a matter of fact, I love him already. Calm down. <laughs> Young lady, say calm down. Don't rush. <laughs> How can you love someone that you have not come in contact with? Huh? <laughs> you know this. Anyway, that's just by the way. I will get in touch with my son on phone and I'll tell him about the situation here and also inform my queen, the lord of this kingdom. We will now decide on what should be done later. Two issue of former here, he will get in touch with you. Okay? Thank you, my Thank you. Thank you, my Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, we've heard what you've said, and that is the proper thing to do. So, uh, we would like to take our leave now. It's all right. It's all right. My regards to your precious family. Thank you, Majesty. Yes. And my regards to Lolo. I will let her know. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Your Majesty. Mm -hmm. Let's be watching. Can you tell me a bit about yourself? Where do you want to know? Mm, I want to know now. I just... I just want to know you beyond just being... My father's tenant. Just nothing, just. My name is Odile. Mm -hmm. I know your name. I'm a graduate of business administration. I'm from a very poor background. My father sold all he had just to see me through school because he wanted the best education for me. But unfortunately, my father is dead now. Oh. Uh, I'm so sorry about that. Um. So you're a graduate? Yes, I am. Wow. No wonder you were able to help me with my assignments the other day. But I'm just I'm just wondering. You could get a job in the city with your certificate as a graduate. I mean you could get any job. So why choose to come to this village to do many jobs? When you can, you can get a job, a, a, a good job in the city. You're right. I mean, securing a job in the city with my qualification is the right thing to do. Mm -hmm. But how do I go about it? How do I cater for myself in the city? 
Where do I get money to rent an apartment? How do I pay for the accommodation? You know how expensive the city is. I can't afford it. That answers your question. Yeah, I... I understand. I know how things can get. Whew. Wow. Please, can I get some food? I'm very hungry. I haven't eaten all day. Um, there's there's food in the house. But um, I would like you to go to your room so that I can sneak the food into your room. <laughs> you see this sister of mine <laughs> over there? Her mouth can run like a tap. So it's best she doesn't even know. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, so you you go in and Sister Umi, what were you discussing with that fool? Hmm? Judith, and who are you calling a fool? You know who I'm talking about. Are you serious? What is your business? Eh? Hey! Hey, sister, you be careful, no? Are, are you mad? Oh, you don't know your mate again, eh? You don't know your mate, okay? Eh? This is your mouth put you in trouble. Don't worry. Is a lucky Are you sure this thing will work? Ah. What do you mean by am I sure this thing will work? I can't understand you. Are you sure the prince will marry me if he comes back? Because I, I don't understand. The, the way the king sounded, it was not too convincing. Look, don't worry yourself. Huh? Relax. You, you heard him. In fact, when he talked about your rushing, I defended you. I said, young children of these days, they rush. Huh? And now he has promised that he will call the son. Huh? You think the king will waste his time and credit to call the son if he's not uh, in approval of what uh, you know what to plan? So just relax. Relax. You're already the princess. <laughs> if I'm very soon, I expect you to be moving and walking. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go. <laughs> You mean my daughter, Amara Chibu, will become the future law law of this kingdom? Or he knew? Agnes, it is settled. <laughs> In fact, <laughs> in a few months from now, the prince will be returning from London and everything will begin to happen. 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 Go to bed. 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 Yes, my dear. There's something I want to say. Go ahead. I want to start dressing as a princess already. Oh. So that when the prince comes back, he will desire me more. What do you think? Agnes, you, you, you see, this is your smartness. You have transferred, transmigrated. In fact, you have 
you, you have inculcated it into your daughter. You can see this madness. You are very correct. By the time he comes, he will now see royalty. You know, royalty meets royalty. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what we do. Okay. <laughs> it's you. I like what both of you just said. But the problem is, I don't have money to buy such dresses for her. You know our condition since my husband died. Even to eat. Agnes, look, I don't like it when you embarrass me. You're embarrassing me. Look, I am a former. I have money. I will take care of all this. In fact, I will provide a special budget for it. Hey, what are you talking about? Hey, wait. With all the things, you know. Why would it? Oh, God. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. People can go inside. See, and I will do more. More. Mama, take him inside. <laughs> ah, come on. Yeah. It's not for babies. You are still a baby. Remember, go you inside. are still a virgin. Go inside, go inside. Eh? Eh. I'm to go inside. Me and she go inside. I want to talk to him. Go inside, go inside. Go inside, let me talk to him. Let me talk to a chair. Go inside, let me talk to a chair. I know you like inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. I'll be going back to the city tomorrow. And I don't know if there's any other thing for me to do. Because I don't want you people to lack anything. My son, Mama. you have tried so much. Thank you, Mama. Hmm? Mama. Just uh, Judith's school fees. And on your chuku here, less than fee. That's not an issue now. I've already settled that. Eh? Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh -uh. I You people did not tell me. He has paid now. Who oh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you so much, my son. Yes. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, and uh, uh, Judith. Mm -hmm. So I'm free now. Ah, no. Eh? When you came home, why are you squeezing your face like that? Now? Ready phone, you promised me. Oh, phone. <laughs> <laughs> what about laptop? Uh, you don't want a laptop. But I only made that promise yesterday, now, eh? Brother, you should have the la laptop. <laughs> no, no, laptop. Don't worry. When I when next I'm coming, eh? I'll buy you. Yeah, Samsung. Yes, Not Samsung. No, 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 no. I'll buy an Apple phone. <laughs> no pineapple phone. <laughs> no no <laughs> good phone. No, pineapple. No, 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 Apple phone. And don't worry. Eh, they are something. Eh, are you not done listening to me? No, no. Judith. Ah, she's a. Me, my sister, we had that. Wow. She's my kid sister now. She needs to be pampered. Uh -huh. mm. What reason should buy a laptop? Go to your mercy. So, both of you came to see me this hot afternoon. Is there any problem? No, no problem, my queen. <laughs> we came to beg you for something very important. I mean, yes. go and I. Yes. Mm. Mm. What could that be? <laughs> Please, our adorable queen, the future queen of this great kingdom. Please, we came to beg you for you to employ us as your maidens. So we'll be following you about anywhere you go. You girls want to become my maiden and my husband's royal home? Yes. yes. I mean, we'll be <laughs> I'm sorry, our dear queen, the future queen of this great kingdom. Yes. Please forgive me. We'll do whatever you want. We'll make your bed, we'll make your food, yes. we'll even worship you, we'll bow to your food. Uh -huh. yes. I'll think about it. I beg of you, there's nothing to think about. You know us now, we are good girls. Yes. Just accept us. I promise, we'll wash your clothes, we'll make your food. Okay, you whatever you want, we'll do it for you. We'll even bow to your feet, please. Yes. Just, just accept us. Iku, please, Iku. please. It's okay. I'll thank you girls, but, but you have to bring 10,000 Naira each for me to use and make your royal maiden attire. You know you guys cannot follow me about looking like this. That is not a problem. As for me, immediately I get home, I'll bring my own money. Hmm? Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. Where 
Wait, oh. Wait, oh. Amara. Mama. I overheard your discussion with your friends. Is there any problem? Are you a fool? How can you accept those girls just like that? So you don't know it's a real business? Huh? Business? How? Oh. You don't know how many girls in this community that would like to take that position? Eh? Oh, you don't know what it means to be a royal maiden. To a royal princess. That means eating royal food, drinking royal water, sleeping and waking up in a royal house. So, Mama, what do I do now? Call them back because I had all your conversation with them. Call them back. Tell them that that 10,000 naira you build them is just for the clothing, that they have to make registration. Yes! Tell them to go and bring huge amounts of money to register. If they have money, if they are ready, I don't have any problem. But if they don't have money, eh, you discharge them. I know there are all that medics in this community that are willing to pay huge amounts of money to be in that sort of problem. Better not be that somebody has taken my position. Mm -hmm. I will know, it will not go down well. Ha! This is my princess. This is my princess. Mm -hmm. I called you girls here because there is a new development. You know, when you are begging me to accept you as my royal maidens, I told you to give me time. Let me digest it. Eh? Well, not do no coco. And you hurriedly hurried me into accepting quickly. But when you left, I realized I made a huge mistake. I hope there is no problem, our queen. Thing is, since you left, almost the entire girls in this community have visited my house. With huge amount of money begging me to take them as my maidens. But, you know me now. I have a good heart. A Zibo mad camp. I said no. You both are my friends. At least let me call you back to know your minds. My princess, please, eh, with, the, with the way you're talking, I know money is involved. Yeah. So tell us, how much are we talking about here? Yes, tell us. Oh, me. Well, like I said, you're my friends. And I wouldn't want to bail you. Let's look at... um. Maybe a token of 25,000 Naira each. As for me, it's okay by me. I don't have a problem with that. I don't know about it. Uh, I've, I've heard you. Yeah. What's my thing? I'm a Why not let us pay 15,000, 15,000 Naira each? Because we'll still we pay money for the maiden school and we'll still pay money for sewing it. So please. Just, just, just think about it. My princess, since I was born, and now I'm getting old, I've not set my eyes on 25,000 naira before. Uh, what I can afford is 5,000 naira. Uh, and the money for the clothes, like Messi rightly said. Or still guinea. 5,000 guinea. Mba. Messi. My queen. Consider yourself one of my royal maidens. Thank you, my queen. I salute you. And as for you, since I was young, till now I'm getting old. Get out of my compound! Five thousand. Please! Wait, wait, it's five thousand. It's less poor thing. My queen, you can go out. My queen, please take it easy with her. You know they don't have enough. I don't want to get angry with you too. Thank you. Thank you, my queen. Bye. You go. You go away for me. Wretched thing. You want to inflict my compound with your poverty self. Nonsense. Which I will made in one age ago. Jesus.
out you wait now why are you walking out so angry why would i walk away why would i walk out no tell me why would i walk away did you see the way she spoke to me must she insult me because they told her that she will marry the prince when he comes back what if the marriage does not hold ah, what is wrong with you what you want to say before you get yourself into trouble See, whether you like it or not, Amara will be the future queen of this kingdom. Digwe has confirmed it. My friend, all you need to do is to look, is to look for a way alternative to raise your own money. As for me, tomorrow I'll raise my own money or this evening I'll go and give it to her. Just hurry up before another girl takes your position. Yeah, let them take it. Who cares? Look at this one. What, what, what is wrong with you, Gochi? Look at the girl I'm, I'm, I'm even trying to help. Look at her like balloon. Anyway, that is your problem. Tomorrow I will go and pay my own money. Lele, somebody I I I I Basil, you're welcome. Don't welcome me, Odili. I have come to collect my money. <sighs> oh, Basil, I told you I will pay you now. Calm down. You now. told me you paid me. You paid I, me. I, I told you I will pay you. I've given you enough time. And I'm tired of you dribbling me and making promises and failing. But you're my friend. Listen to me. See, if you don't give me that money now, we go to the police and sort that ourselves. I, I am your friend. I'm going to the police station. We'll solve anything. Now, me, you are whose friends? Oh, are you from this community or are you related to me in any way? So, because you asked me to borrow you money and I borrowed you that money, you think you're my friend? Basi, come down. Well, shut up. <laughs> if you know what is good for you now, before I call my bride to come and pick you up, pay me that money now. Okay, just wait and see. You see what happened to you now. Excuse me, please. Excuse me, uh, Mr. Basil. I'm sorry. I, I couldn't help but to listen to your quarrel. I mean, your voice was loud enough. So, I, I heard everything. You see, he has actually pleaded with you well enough. But you seem to have made up your mind on what you want to do. But come on, going to the police will not help anyone. Even if you go there, you still spend money. It doesn't matter whether your brother is the DPO of that station. But that's by the way. Please, how much does he owe you? My money is 7,000 Naira. 7,000? Yes. Uh, Odili, you heard him. Is that how much you owe him? Um, yes, but... I, I, no, 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 but don't worry. Um, I'll be back in. I'll be back shortly. Please, your voice. Tell her to come bring that money for me. Basil, mind yourself, oh. Take your time. You. Take your time. Yeah, I've, I've helped you now. What I'm you're doing is not good. I thought you were my friend. Who's your friend? You're coming here to scream Who's at me. Shut up. Who's because I friend? got money from you. Oh. What's your problem? Oh, because you came to me and asked me to borrow you money. I borrowed you the money. She's bringing your money. Come down, my friend. friend. Are you from this country? Oh, please, 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 get out. Do you know anyway? Please, please shut up. Can you not Excuse me, sir. Please. There's no point making noise in my compound. Take your money and get out. Your stupid money. Just thank you, God, that she saved you. What would you have done? Please, it's okay, Mr. Basil. Father, Father Abraham, look okay. your beard. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay? Um, Judith, let's go. Hmm? What was the meaning of what you just did now? What was what? That I helped someone, a human being. Oh. What's wrong with that? You helped. Yes. You have a problem with that? Mm, no. <coughs> Let's go then. I don't know your plans in this house, but whatever evil plans you have against this family, you will not succeed. We are one in this life. We are all holy. Stop looking down at me. Do you want me to die just like that? Chere, chere, chere. Agnes, are you telling me that there is a girl or a group of girls in this kingdom that have the, the, the audacity, the, the, the temerity, uh, I mean the impetus to, to, to insult Amala, our future queen? Is that what you're telling me? Iche. If you are asking me this question, it's making me to go more crazy. If you are speaking all this grammar, eh? you're making me to go more crazy. I just told you what happened. And you are here speaking grammar. Impetus. What we need now is solution. I'm not so more evil. Take it easy now. Hmm? What will be? 
the anger is too much. I, I'm not the one who did it. Hmm? Don't worry. I will provide a solution. In fact, I will find a solution to it. Whatever you want to yes. do, eh? Do it very fast. Do it quick. You know what? In fact, I have a solution. You do? Yes. <laughs> Spell it out. I suggest my daughter move into the palace and stay there. Oh. Yes. Let her stay in the palace till the, the prince comes. Since Igor has accepted her to be the, the, the future queen, the, the, the prince and wife, let her go there and stay. I think that will save all this embarrassment. Hey! Agnes, you see, I, I've always known that you are very smart. No wonder you captured my heart. <laughs> Don't worry. I will go and meet Igwe. Eh? I will convince him. I will make sure Amara moves into the palace. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I'll do it. Ichi, mm. you have to do that though. Yeah. Do that and do it very fast. Okay. If not, you will not have me again. Ah, uh, Agnes. Uh, it doesn't come to that. You don't need to threaten me. I've told you I will meet the ego. Don't worry, it's like you don't need me again. I'm a formal. I have solution to all problems. What are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, if you do that, that means you are going to have me to the rest of your life. You will have me forever. Look, I have already had you forever. Yes, because I have done it. <laughs> Take it to the bank. I. Hey. And the children. No what you are trying to tell me now is that uh, I should allow the said girl to move into the palace and uh, live with us. Exactly, Your Majesty. I am of the opinion that uh, our prince will be so delighted to come home and meet his future wife. Our future lord, you know. Moreover, I think it is important that uh, she comes in here, understudy the people around, learn royalty, so that uh, by the time the prince comes back, he will be meeting royalty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. My precious beautiful queen, do you have anything to say or add to what uh, Ichie former said? <clears throat> Your Majesty, you know you have the final say in this. Though I don't know the girl in question because I have not met her. But if you ask me, I would say I agree with what Ichie or former just said now. Oh. So that we have time to study the girl, know her very well. And of course, you know the kind of a woman our son needs for a wife. Yes, sure. Sure. Ah. It's your father. Thank you very much for this wonderful idea of yours. We have heard what you said. And um, we have to get in touch with our son for him to know the situation around us now. And after that, we can now know when the girl will move in and live with us. Thank you once again. <laughs> you are very correct, Your Majesty. You know, considering the, what happened in the past, he also will be anxious. And the girl staying in the palace means that uh, by the time he returns, he will be meeting royalty. Eh? Uh, don't forget what happened in the other case that he eventually did not marry her. Yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you very much, your It's your fault. <laughs> I will miss count on you. You can trust me. <laughs>
Onyinye Onyinye Come here For the past few days I came back home, I noticed you've not gone for lesson. And this morning, you've not even made an attempt of leaving this house. Why now? See, brother, just, just forget this matter. Nothing. What do you mean, nothing? Huh? Nothing now, brother, nothing. Ah. Why are you telling me nothing? Why have you not gone for ah, lesson? Which one's now? It's like you have a, an already built up opinion. You have, is there an answer you're expecting? I've said nothing, nothing, nothing. You're still asking. Brother, you cannot say anything here. Even if you ask her from now to next month. Ha. Judith, what do you mean by that? Brother, because brother, she, she has not... You need to let me talk. Brother, she has not paid for her lesson fees. What do you mean she has not paid for her lesson fees? I remember the last time I came back home. I gave you your school fees and I gave her a lesson fee. So what happened to the money? Brother, she... What happened to the money now? She she used the money you gave her to uh, bail the lay out. Okay. The day the person he was there, he came here with poli um, police to arrest him. So she she stole near you at the good Samaritan used the money you gave her for the lesson fee. <laughs> What Judith is saying, is it true? Eh? Answer me, answer me, eh? What did she say? What she's saying, is it true? I did not hear anything, I was not here. What did you say? <coughs> uh, uh, Judith, <coughs> is Papa hey, and Mama aware of this? Papa is not aware, but I told Mama she didn't say anything. <sighs> it's alright, it's alright, no problem. No trouble, you can go. You can go. You can go. Ichi, you mean everything is settled now? Agnes. I don't know why you don't trust me. Don't you know what I'm capable of doing? Eh? No. Very soon. Your daughter Amara will move into the palace as the prince's wife and our future queen. <laughs> Look, I told you I was going to sort out everything. Hmm? Hey, you said it and you did it. Of course. That is why I always talk about you. I wish you were my husband. Hmm. It's like you people are. Uh, uh, the two of us are doing what? Uh, even at that, uh, we are doing it for your own good. Instead of you to be happy, you are here uh, saying what I don't understand. I am happy, yo. Oh. I am happy. Uh, what do you think? I am extremely happy. I can't wait to break this good news to Ogochi. Oh, please. Leave that wretched girl. My queen, please forgive her. I have a special message for you. Let us go inside. Special message. <laughs> you see, I like messages. But I love special messages. Sorry. <laughs> 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 Hey, this bull will not kill me. Hmm? I won't kill you, my friend. Shut up! See my mother blush. Blushing. <laughs> like a small girl. Hmm. 
So you mean Amara is going into the palace as the prince's wife and the future queen of this kingdom? You bro, why are you surprised? No, it, it baffles me that you're still surprised. When I was telling you to pay your to pay your money, you refused, saying that the, the, the prince might not marry her. Look at it now. Maybe because are no oh, please help me beg Amara to take me. I am ready to pay the money now. I'm ready. My dear. You know Amara has smelling attitude. I'll talk to her, but I'm not promising anything. Hey, meh, meh. You know we are good friends, so. Henry, you can't leave me behind. Please help me beg Amara to take me back. Just help me beg her. Oh, maybe cool. I have to join you. I can't be in this village and you people will just go to the palace, so. The apple may back. Look at you begging. No, the other day, just the other day here, you were your mouth was so sharp. Who cares? The prince might not even marry her. Who did she think she is? Now look at you. Begging, please, sir. Uh, you will not leave me behind. Anyway, I know you're silly, but you're still my friend. I'll, I'll beg her, I'll talk to her for you. Hi. Thank you very much. <laughs> Help me talk to her. Oh, oh hi. hi. I need to join you people. I need to join you people. I can't be It's so okay. Here. Let's go. Let's go home, John. Oh, God, please help me, help me melt Amara's heart so that she can forgive me and take me back. Mama Bikono, Mama, please, I want you to help me. Initially, I thought it was a lie until I saw Mercy today and she told me that the Igwe has accepted Amara as the prince's wife and the future queen of this kingdom. Mama, you know what it means to be a maid in the palace. So, Mama, I'll be moving to the palace and I want to be part of them. Ugochi, my daughter. Mm -hmm. It is a good thing to live in the palace as a queen maid because it is an honor. But, are you sure this is real? Mama, this is for real. You know, I've never lied to you before. I swear it's for real, Mama. Why I'm saying all this is because I don't want to hear stories tomorrow. Mm -mm. No stories. It's all right. I will give you the money. <gasps> but not now. To be tomorrow. I'll look for somewhere to find you. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Mama. God bless you. Hey! Hey! Thank you. <laughs> Papa, Mama, there is something I observed this morning that I'm still finding it difficult to understand. And I want you, my father and my mother, to tell me, when last on you here went to lesson? Well, my son, I don't really know. But all I can tell you now is that for some time, Onye has not gone to lesson. And what about you, Mama? Well, it's up to one week. She went for lesson last. But Ohinye is here. Why not ask her to tell you herself? Mama, the question is, did you, her parent, bother to ask her her reasons for not going to lesson? Because if you did, obviously, you would have known her reasons. Judith here told me that Ohinye here used her lesson fee to give to that useless boy called Odile. Simply because his debtor threatened to arrest him with the police. And because of that, she has not paid her fees and she has not been going for lesson. Oh yeah. Is it true? Ujak, are you aware of it? Before Judith here told me, Onine has already done that. And when I asked her, to tell me the reason she did it. She did not give me any good reason. Ha! And Nai, you know Oninechi, your daughter. She can use her last kobo to solve another person's problem and leave her own behind. We cannot change her. It's her life. Hi! 
thank God, I have a Judith, my lovely daughter. I do she's not as as, as useless as we need. Be a good girl, as you are. Eh? And make sure you don't behave like her. Eh? Anything you want in this life, I will get it for you. I will buy it for you. Eh? My lovely daughter. Oh, what class. Eh? Uh -huh. Good. Opa, Opa, Do what? Opa, Papa. Mama. Brother. <sighs> I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry for what I did. I am not I'm not proud of what I've done. But I didn't have a choice. I couldn't bear to watch him being arrested by the police over something I know that I could be of help. That's why I gave him my, my fees. I'm so sorry, Papa. I'm sorry for letting you all down. But he promised he promised he's going to pay back. I'm sorry. Oninye, I am disappointed at you. Now that you have used your fees to solve his own problem, how do you intend to solve yours? How do you intend to write your jump? He'll pay back. Now listen to me. For no reason will I ever sponsor your education again until you learn how to be reasonable. And by the way, what is that boy's mission in this house? Huh? My son, don't worry. Just relax, don't worry. I know what to do. I want it. Don't worry. Odebi, I called you here this morning to inform you that I'm giving you two weeks to look for a house elsewhere and pack out. I don't know what's your mission in this house. You have caused us a lot of problems. But brother Samson, hey, 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 hey. Problems. Sh quiet, quiet your face. I don't want to listen to you. I do not want to hear anything from you. Now you listen to me. I do not want to go and come back and meet you in this house next time. Else, you will not like what I will do to brother you. Brother Samson, how am I causing I have told you. We are one in this life. Oddly, I overheard all my son was telling you. Don't worry, you are not going anywhere. I will talk to him and my husband. Eh? Just make sure you pay your rent when due. Do you hear me? Yes, ma. I heard all you said. I promise to pay my rent. I promise not to disappoint you. It's okay. Huh? Just make sure you do whatever I ask you to do. We are one in this life. We are all home and stop looking down at me. We are one in this life. We are all home and stop looking down at me. Yes. Yes, your mother is fine. In fact, all of us are very fine. It's just that uh, your mother, in short, everybody is missing you. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. About that girl that um, 
Ichio Forma brought to the palace for you to marry. Yes, I, I want to seek for your permission to bring her into the palace to stay with us. Yes, so that we will study her closely before you return. Mm -hmm. Is that okay by you? Very good, very good. I will do just that. I will, in fact, I will send for her. Yes. It's okay, my soul. Thank you very much. Bye bye. What is the meaning of this kind of dressing? And who are these things standing behind you? Uh, my queen, I, I, I... Just wait a minute, okay? Uh, my queen. If she is stop, don't speak for her. Allow her to talk. You heard me very well. So what is the meaning? My queen, the reason is I want to start practicing on how to dress like a princess and the future queen of this land. But if you don't like it, I don't mind. I'll just go and change. It's okay. It's okay. My queen, this is no time for this. She just arrived. Okay? We'll talk about it later. Uh, um, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Thank you, my queen. Thank you. Um, the chair, your majesty. Like I told you on the phone, we have uh, discussed with our son in London, and uh, he has given us his permission to allow her come in and uh, stay with us, yeah? so that we will know her better. <laughs> your majesty. That was a very wise decision by our prince. You see, he is going to like her very much. In fact, he will love her. Because she's uh, homegrown, well taken care of, well brought up. And on top of that, most importantly, she's a virgin. <laughs> Uh, no, no, you can take it to the bank. <laughs> so, uh, thank you very much, Your Majesty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, uh, You're welcome. God, go and call one of the maidens for me. So that they can take her to bank. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, my friend. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. She's already part of
look good. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> Your Majesty. <laughs> Look at both of you. You're looking good. <laughs> and dad is even looking younger. You can say that again, my princess. <laughs> say it again! <laughs> what is that? Am I not looking younger too? No, tell me. Oh. I smell jealousy. I know. I know. Oh? Mom, don't tell me you're jealous. <laughs> Okay, fine. Mom, you look younger than dad. Are you happy now? Oh, I'll be that, you can say that again. Mm -hmm. Now you are talking. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you look younger than mom. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> yeah. Now tell me. Yes, mom. Are you trying to tell me that you are now a graduate? That you are done with school. Is that it? Yes, mom. Hey. Your daughter is now a graduate. Meaning, you will no longer come to tell me, mommy, I need money for this book, I need for that, I need... Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm like, oh, <laughs> that's nice. Yes, mom, you're Thank welcome. You. Thank you. <laughs> Daddy. I am happy for you. Chuck, I am very, very proud of you. Thank you, Dad. We Thank proud you. of you. We are proud of you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Um, mom. Dad. Yes. Um, about my youth service. Let's talk about it. Yeah. I would love to serve in this state. Because before you know it, they'll just throw me in one of the northern states. Hmm? Please, Dad. I would want you to work it out for me. I want to serve in this state. Please. Is that all you want? Yes, mom. So that you can be very close to your mom, right? Yes, mom. Uh, so that Just... she can be very close to us. Exactly. Okay, whatever. Consider it done, darling, okay? What? Really? Mm -hmm. <gasps> My princess. Daddy. Consider it. Well, come. <laughs> thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> okay, um. Let me go upstairs and freshen up. Okay, that's. What is that? Um, Mom, who was that arrogant girl I saw outside when I came back? I saw her dressed like a princess living in the palace with some maidens following her. Who is she? Um, darling, her name is Amara. She's your brother's wife to be. I mean, the prince. What? My brother's wife to be? Where is my brother? Where is oh, the prince? The prince traveled to London a few months ago. Yes. How come nobody told me about it? He didn't even call me on phone. Um, darling, let me tell you what happened. You see, his traveling came as an emergency, so we have to let him go. Yes. But I will explain a lot to you later, okay? Uh, but mom, this is not fair. How can my brother travel and he didn't even tell me? I just said I will explain yes. to you later. Just be happy because we are happy you are back. <laughs> we are more happy that you are now a full graduate from the university. Yes, Dad. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Um, yeah. Okay, I'll be back soon. Yeah, we're happy you're back. Me too, Dad. Huh? I now have a graduate. Yes, we now have a graduate. No, you, you had one already. Your son, my daughter is now a graduate. But that is the only daughter of the house and the daughters are more closer to yeah. Is that the yes, how much? No, no. 78 pounds is too small now. Eh? It's not even up to the cost price. Okay, fine. This is it. I traveled. When I return, I'll call you. I'll call you now. Come down. I'll call you. Eh? Alright, thank you. Only! Only! Brother! Uh, Bigo, please, get me what I'll do. Okay. Yeah. 
Bro, Samson. Yeah. Um, I'd like to speak to you about something very important. About what? Sit down. Like I said, it's very important. I think I like your sister, Onyinye. She looks like a wife material. So, meaning what? Why are you telling me, telling me this? Because I know you're a young man like me. You will definitely understand. Understand what, suddenly? What do you want me to understand? Huh? You foolishly walked up to me to tell me that you like my sister on me. Odile, don't you know your level? Eh? And what has that got to do with you? A lot, something. You won't understand now. But I'm sure you will later. Odile, let it not be what I'm thinking. Because even in the whole wide world, you will not get it. Just get out of here, Greg. Will you get out of here? I said, get out of here! Fool! You like my sister, Anya? Yeah? Oh, you know! This boy will kill me. Oh, you know! Brother! Let's see what I ask you to bring now. Give me a bag. Let me see you close to my sister. I'll just remove something from your body. It's here. Agnes. You are welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Please, how did it go? Oh, that question is embarrassing. I am a former. Can you ask me how did it go? Just look at the time. If by this time your daughter is not back, don't you think that I've finished everything? <laughs> eh? <laughs> In fact, as I speak with you, eh, your daughter is now royalty. You, you need to see the way she was walking there. <laughs> see, I trust you. You are a good man. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yes. How is it going to be? Oh, why can you be asking me that question again? Eh? You know now, I'm not yours. Eh? But wait, let me go home. Eh? I will come back at night. Eh, night is always better now, you understand? Uh, uh, Overnight. <laughs> Ichi. Yes. Are you coming back at night? What about your wife and children? Oh. This is the third insult. Hmm? Another insult. What are you talking about? You don't know me again, a former. Look, I have ways of handling every issue. I, yes, <laughs> now I'm taking care of all that. <laughs> <laughs> don't I'll be back. Mm. Yes. Yeah, 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 please, when you're coming in, eh? don't allow your wife to know about it. I, I don't want any trouble. Oh. Eh? See, you are trying to make the insults fall now. <laughs> no. Why now? Eh? Okay. <laughs> so, I'll go back. To you. I've been waiting here for you. I I'm so sorry. I was doing something. But I'm here now. Is everything okay? Yes. Everything is fine. So why did you bring me here? Huh? Well, I, I brought you here because I do not want my parents, my brother and my sister to see us together. Hey. There's something I would love to discuss with you. 
you want to collect your money back oh no because I, I don't have it no come on relax it's it's not my money it's not about my money okay what is it then okay so um yesterday i overheard you talking with my brother mm. i was a part of the conversation i heard everything clearly and that got me a bit confused because i don't know what your plans really are i mean what's your intention towards me and my family i'm just thinking about everything i heard you say to my brother and i thought i should ask what's 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 up mm -hmm. thank you so much for what i've been looking for an opportunity like this to tell you how i feel so i want to thank you again for making it possible for us to come together and speak our minds Yes. Thank you. Thank you for everything. Thank you for all your support towards me since I came into your father's compound. You've been a source of inspiration to me. I am so proud of your parents. I'm so proud of how they raised you. You're young, but you don't act your age. You're very mature. I like the way you handle situations. I like how organized you are. You're a good woman. You saved me. You remember when my friend came to get me arrested? He promised he was going to call the police to arrest me. See what you did. You came into our midst and you solved the problem. Onye, I'm not going to lie. Your wife material. So, what? What are you trying to say? Yes. You know I'm not getting younger. I, I know I had my reservations about getting married. But each time I see you, I feel like getting married. In fact, I want to marry you. I want to make you my wife. I, I feel like if you come into my life as my wife, you, you're going to help build me. You're, I'm going to be structured as a man. But the problem is, I don't know how to get married to you without money. You know fully well that I'm from a poor background. I, 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 I'm afraid because I, I know I won't be able to take care of you. Stop. I wish I had money. Stop. I, I'll, I'll take you. I'll take care of stop. you. Stop. I'll take you out of this place. You're very educated. I'll pay. Stop. For, please stop. What do you mean, please? Only. Okay. Please, just stop. Listen, I've always promised stop. myself that if, if you marry me, I'll, I'll love you so much. Stop! Stop. Oye. Stop. Oye. Hey. I said it. I said it. Poverty is such a disease. Poverty is a disease. No woman likes to get married to a poor man. No woman wants to associate with poverty. Oddly. Hey! You have to make money. Oh. Oddly, J. Choyogo. And look for money. Mm -hmm. 
два. Did you greet me? Yes, my princess. I doubt. Because shut up. Because I did not see your mouth move. I did, my princess. Now you all listen and listen carefully. I am the princess and the future queen of this land. I'm in charge of every affair in this palace. So, my instructions stand. You. I do not have any business with you. By the way, where are your colleagues? They are on duty, my princess. They are on duty? Were well, they not aware I called for this? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, shut up. Back to what I was saying. I do not have any issue with you. But where I will have problems with you is if I see any of you loitering this compound looking dirty. Hmm. Then you will know exactly who I am. Get out. Back to you. From today, I don't want you maidens following me around like flies. As you can see, I have my maidens. What did you do? Uh, what did you do? I'm sorry, my presence. As I was saying, I do not want to see you maidens following me around. You can do that with the law. But that does not mean you should not wash my clothes and dress my room. Is that clear? Yes, ma'am. But my princess, we have washing machine in this palace. And it's not our duty to wash clothes. Will you shut up your mouth? I can see that you're going to be my problem here. I'm sorry, my princess. For talking back at me, you are going to wash the entire compound. I mean, scrub the compound. Starting from now. Yes, sir, my princess. Please forgive. Who is this? Are you talking to me? Yes, you will join. Shut up! You will join her in the punishment. Both of you will wash the entire compound, scrub the floor from the front to the backyard. Foolish things. Have I made myself clear? I'm sorry, please forgive me. I said, shut up. This is beautiful kingdom. Hey, this is beautiful kingdom. I wonder where they brought her from. She's as wicked as Jezebel. I wonder what this palace will turn into if she stay here in the next six months. Then, eh? Six months. I will just resign from this palace before she turns me into her slave. Uh-uh. What is going on here? Who asked you to do this? Talk! Your mother is the new princess. 
You mean Amara? Yes, my queen. Why? Why did she? And, and where is she? We don't know. She told us to stop following her, that we are only assigned to you. And she even told us to start washing her clothes and dress her room. I was trying to explain to her that we have washing machine in this palace and she gave us this punishment. You know what? You girls should drop those things and go inside. God! Yes, go and fetch that Amara now. Tell her I want to see her now! Amara, I believe you hate them correctly. Is it true? Am I not talking to someone? Yes, my queen. But why would they be talking back at me while I was giving them orders? Which orders are you talking about? No, tell me. Did you employ them? Did you even know how they came into this palace? Now listen. This should be the last time you try this. Else, I will send you and your mates out of this palace. You heard me. But my queen, why would you be talking to me this way in their presence? Because you caused it. And listen very well. I will not warn you again. And you? For the fact I corrected her mistakes before you does not give you the right to talk to her anyhow. You still respect her as the prince's wife and the future queen of this kingdom. Have I made myself clear? Yes, my queen. Good. Now, you maidens can go. Yes, my queen. Amara, come back here. What are you two waiting for? Get out! Look at them. Amara, listen and listen good. Let this be the first and the last. Never allow this nonsense that happened to repeat. If you do, you will lose your position. Yes, you heard him. Now get out of my presence. Get out. This is beautiful kingdom. Hey, this is beautiful kingdom. Let me give my to my son. It's okay, That's my queen. Nonsense, it's okay. You have corrected her, and I believe she will learn her lesson. Okay? She better do. Come down. <sighs> Oni, what is it? Since you got here, you've not said anything. What is bothering you? I have a problem. Obviously. It is written all over your face. What is it? Do you remember that guy I told you about? That our tenant? Is it that one that you saved from the police? That was only some money. That later took you to his poor wretched family and... No, no, no. Go on. That's not all. That one that was poor. That one that the father was poor and... What is wrong with you? You need to read out his entire biography for me to know that you remember him, okay? What kind of talk is that? Just of course, he's the one. Oh. I just want to be sure we're talking about the same person now. Okay, now you know. He's the same person. Mm. You have to rub it on my face. That one that was poor. So what about him? <clears throat> he, he said he wants to marry me. <laughs> Oh, what did you say? I've not said anything to you. That's why I am here. Discussing with you to see if you have any advice for me. So, 
Have you told your parents about it? Of course not. Hey, hmm. you think if I told my parents about it, I will not be homeless by now. They will send me out of the house. <laughs> That's not even an option yet. So what do you have in mind? I have in mind and I'm here asking for advice. Now what for you? Please, I don't have anything in mind. Do you have an advice for me or not? What do you think? Oh. <laughs> my friend, this matter is serious. So. See, I don't even know what to tell you. See, if I ask you now to accept him, and something goes wrong tomorrow, you will say I pushed you into it. And if I say don't accept him, and it becomes something tomorrow, you will still say I made him miss an opportunity. Yeah. I don't know what to say. Okay, so in a nutshell, what are you saying? Because you're even confusing me the more. Just follow your mind. Just ask yourself if you love him or not. That is it. Okay, so that's all you have to tell me. Okay. Thank you very much. Are you living like that? No, I'm coming. I didn't say anything wrong now. I just said my mind. Ah, ah. Ayinechi, what is it you want to tell me that cannot wait till tomorrow morning? And why is your face like that? Mama, what I want to tell you is very important. Talk. But first, you, you will have to promise me you won't tell Papa about it. What is it? Mama, tell just me. promise me first. Okay. Please. Tell me. I promise you. Cross your heart. Oh? Huh? Mm -hmm. I cross my heart. Okay. You won't tell Papa about it. I promise. Mama. It's <clears throat> it's actually about orderly. What about orderly? Uh, orderly asked me <clears throat> to marry him. I don't understand you. You mean oddly asked you to marry him? Yes. And what did you tell him? I I haven't told him anything yet. I thought I should tell you first before knowing what to do. <sighs> now you have told me what is in your mind. I actually don't have anything in mind right now. I'm still I'm still thinking about it, Mama. I don't know. It is okay. Hmm? You have to go and sleep. Pray over it first. 
and make sure whatever is your decision, let me know first before telling him anything. Thank you very much, Mama. Thank you. Good night. Good My son, I've seen the drink. You're welcome once again. Thank you, Owner. Uh, you said your name is Fred. Yes, Owner. And uh, from this community. Yes, Owner. And uh, you came to ask for my daughter's hand in marriage. Yes. You're welcome. Thank you, Owner. Uh, Thank you. 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 Thank Unfortunately, he went to the city for his medical checkups. I decided to come see you alone so that you will give me a date. Thereafter, I will come together with my father to see you. Okay, there's no problem. But uh, which of my daughters are you talking about? Oyinye. Oyinye. Yes, sir. Oyinye. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, there's no problem. Uh, in that case, I will call Oyinye to come out here. For you to be sure that you know the person you are talking about. No problem. Eh? Okay. Um, Papa. Come. Now you are Papa. Come. Papa. 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 Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, is she the one you are talking about? Yes, no, she's the one. I see. Yes. Um, you can go. I will talk to her later. Ah, Papa Umbao, there's no need now. I'm already here. Ah, there will not be any need for me to go inside. Don't I mean, worry. I said go inside. I will talk ah, to you later. Papa Umba. Ah, ah, there's nothing for us to talk about later. We can as well do it now. Let's just summarize it. After all, I'm present here. He's here. You are also here. So, what better time than now? Of course, I know the reason is here. Is it not to marry me? Yes. Oh. Ah. So it's it's an open secret, Okuya. Okay? Yes. Uh -huh. So it's a marriage proposal, isn't it? Yes. Uh -huh. And in proposals like this, it's either you accept or you reject. That's true. Right? Yes. Uh -huh. And I'm not under any form of jurex. It's not by force. That's what I mean. Yes. Uh -huh. I am not interested in your marriage proposal, sir. Mm. So there's really nothing for us to think about later. There's nothing I'll be discussing with Papa after now. I refuse. In this case. So, my advice to you is there is no point coming back here because of this subject matter. We have summarized it to call the long story short. I am not interested. Okay? Uh -huh. Well done, Sao. Well done. Eh? Papa, we have summarized it. We have cut the long story short. Have a nice day. Uh -huh. Sir, remember, you don't have any reason. Eh? to come back here to discuss this except you are here to see my father you understand uh -huh. oh bye no worry you know my daughter she likes jokes no she's not joking nine are you really sure she was joking uh -huh. my daughter She's joking. Can't you see her? She was uh, uh, smiling, dangling when she was saying that to show that she was joking. Uh, uh, my, she liked jokes. Okay. Uh, she, she was joking. Uh, is it not my daughter? I know her too well. It's don't okay. worry, she's your wife. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay, okay. Uh, don't worry. Uh, my regards to your father. 
Thank you. Yeah. So okay. let me be on my way now. Okay now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hey, okay, you go. Yeah, me sir. Don't worry, don't worry. She's your wife. <laughs> We shall see. We shall see. Oh, yeah, Chuku. Oh, yeah, Chuku. Oh, yeah, Chuku. What is your problem? Why are you choosing to reject all the men that came to seeking for her the marriage? Eh? Yeah? Papa, please. Papa, Biko. Papa, have my cow. Please, oh. I beg of you. I am not ready for this. I have a lot on my mind. There's so much bothering me, Papa. Besides, I am not ready for marriage. When I am ready, I will announce it. You are not ready for marriage now. Mm. When you are ready, you will announce it. Mm -hmm. And when will that be? Papa, like I said, when I am ready, I will announce it. I will make it public. I will say it. I will make it known. People will hear about it. You are going to know. I will tell you. Hey. When you are ready, you will go to the television houses, mm. radio houses, even CNN, and announce it. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yes. But then you must have chased all of them away and marry yourself. Eh? You must have chased all of them away and marry yourself. Woman, did you hear your daughter? You heard your daughter? Talk to her. Talk to your daughter. Talk to me. Talk to her. Hey. Hey. Talk to her. Nay, I've heard her. She said that she is not ready. Mm. That when she is ready, mm. she will let you know. Ah, mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. of public knowledge. Mm. She said she is not ready. When she ready, she will let me know. Uh, okay. That means both of you plan this. Both of you plan this. It's okay. No problem. I will be waiting. But mama. Why are you supporting sister? Mm? Uh -uh. Why are you supporting her? This thing you, you both are doing is not good though. It's not good though. She's not getting any younger now. Hey! Make a wanza! If I slap you, eh? Yeah! No, no, let her run her mouth now. Mama, let her run her mouth. Do I blame her? Stupid girl. If you open this gutter, you come out again. I will shut it up for you. Make you idea! Wanza! Mama, I'll shut up my mouth. But nobody should block my way where my own husband will come. Wow. They can't do that too. Nobody can do that. I'm here. Can you imagine? When your own husband. I've suffered. Chai. Abo. Um, what is that her name again? Judith. Uh -huh. Judith. Oh yeah. Get inside. Hey. The meeting is huh? over. Why? Get where? Inside the She's not going anywhere. Stay here. Let me see who will touch you. You are not going anywhere. She's not going anywhere. You are not going anywhere. Okay. Stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop. 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 Ah, easy. What is going on here? Amara, what is the meaning of this rubbish? I don't understand. What are you calling rubbish? Hey, you, get up. Leave this place at once. We have a very What is your problem? What is wrong with them filing my nails and, and giving me ice cream? Now you listen to me. I don't want this rubbish to repeat itself. Do you hear me? <laughs> 
What is your problem? What exactly is your problem? Hmm? All these things I'm doing is not to look good for your brother, my husband to be. Thank God you said husband to be. My princess, don't tell her. She's just jealous of you. I know. You know you're more beautiful than she is. <laughs> of course I am. Mm -hmm. Feed me. This is beautiful kingdom. Oh, oh, this is beautiful kingdom. Are you me? Hey, <laughs> I love this. And this? Darling, who got you angry? Talk to me. Mom, I don't understand what is happening in this palace anymore. Can you imagine? I walked out there and I saw Amara dressed like a princess. What sort of nonsense is that? Eh? And some maidens were painting her nails. The other one was feeding her ice cream. Eh? I don't understand. As a queen or what? Um, darling, you know what? Allow her to be until your brother comes back. He's already away that she is here. He will be the one to decide, okay? But no! It's okay. Well, she can go ahead and try that nonsense with the ones she brought. After all, that bet of the same feather. But for the ones you employ, let her not try that nonsense again with them. I'll talk to her, okay? So come on, come, come soon. Why are you doing this to me? Why haven't I heard anything from you? Why haven't you said anything about my proposal? Why are you keeping quiet? Does it matter where I go? What do you mean? Do you care matter? where I go to? Of course I care. It does matter where you're going. Onye, stop pretending. Stop pretending you care about me because you don't. You hate me so much because I am poor. How but let me tell you something. You don't know tomorrow. Nobody knows tomorrow. How can you even say that? How can I possibly hate you? I don't hate you. If you don't hate me, why have you been quiet? Why haven't you answered my question? So, 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 is, is, that, is that enough reason for you to leave? Onye, I've been in that house depressed. It's better for me to live here than stay in that house and die in silence. Goodbye! Hey, Odili, please, come. Wait. Please. Um. Yes. I'll marry you.
you marry me. Yes. What stopped you from saying it? So... Why are you keeping it to yourself? You're not leaving. I used to live in. Yeah, so... You don't, you don't have to go. Yes. I mean, yes. Say something. Come on. So, Nyechi, what you are telling me now is that you have accepted Odile to marry you and you've told him. Yes, Mama. Huh? Why didn't you tell me before telling him as we discussed? Mama, I I'm, I'm so sorry about that. It was unintended. The whole situation brought about it. I just couldn't bear but to tell him my mind. But I'm, I'm really very sorry, Mama. I'm sorry for not letting you know first. It is okay. Well, since you have accepted to marry him, eh? no problem. Oddly is a nice man. But the issue there is that he is very poor. How is he going to take care of you? How? Mama, I... I know that he's poor. But we'll manage. Eh? God will take care of us. <sighs> Mama, see, something else bothers me more than the poverty part you're talking about. And what is that? Hmm. It's Papa. Oh. Yeah. I'm just wondering how Papa would react to all of this. <sighs> I know how Papa can be. <sighs> hey, don't worry yourself about your father. Hmm? He's my husband. I know how to handle him. Hmm? Don't worry. <laughs> Mamazi, you have to just try because I'm more scared of Papa than Odili being poor and cannot take care of me. Because I know that as for that, ha, huh, nobody knows tomorrow. Anybody can become anything. We'll be fine. <laughs> but Papa, oh, ah. That is why I'm supporting you. Nobody knows tomorrow, as you said, my daughter. Kill him, This is the boy. This is your best. Let the old grandmother that came back know you. No, I'm taking care of it, Daddy. Papa. About that girl you told me last time you want to marry. Yes. What is her name? From which family is she? For her name is Onyinye. Mazi Bekwe's daughter. Give me. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Hey, that marriage will not work. Uh -uh. Papa, why? Do you know how many suitors that girl has rejected? Both rich and poor. Look, if you love that family and you want to marry from that family, it's better we go for the younger daughter, Judith. She's very beautiful and nice. Judith? Yes. But, Papa, I don't know her too well. Just as you don't know her too well. If he had known you, you will know that she will not even look at your face, talk about uh, uh, marrying you. Let's go for Judith. She's very beautiful and nice. Judith. Yes. <sighs> okay, Papa, if you say so, no problem. Yeah, that's my son. <laughs> that's my son. I'm sure you should make a good wife. I eh? agree. Can I agree. Papa. <laughs> <laughs> 
papa. You don't do this one now. You have to do a city only. Your Majesty. I'm beginning to suspect you. Ah! Each time I come to the palace, I will see this drink. Why? Or how? <laughs> Why? Each year. I am one of the distributors of this drink. Ah. Yes. Hmm. Now I understand. Yes. It's a nice drink, though. It is. Yeah. Mm, anyway, each year, Your Majesty. I called you because of the girl Amara. The one you brought to this palace for my son to marry. Amara. I want you to warn her because of her useless behaviors. If not, she will not like what will happen to her if my son returns. Your Majesty. Now I'm totally confused. Please talk to me. What has she done? A lot. There is nothing this lady has not done in this palace. Useless behavior. I want you to warn her before had I known becomes her friend. Your Majesty, to tell you the truth. I am totally perplexed. Oh. I mean, Amara is supposed to consider her background. I mean, the circumstances that led to her coming to the palace. Lenny Anno. Ihona I know she's bringing disrepute to her family and even myself who recommended her and brought her here. Um. Your Majesty, please, I, I must apologize on her behalf. Um, I will talk sense into her. I'm very sure she will change. Hmm? You better do. You better do before it's too late for her. I will. I can assure you I will, I will talk to her. It's okay. Sure, go. Why are you talking to me in that manner? Why? Amara, you are screaming at me. I, Ichi Ofoma. Ofoma mm -mm, Ichi. Simply because I'm advising you for your own good. What kind of advice is that? What kind of advice is that? To the best of my knowledge, I have not done anything wrong. So you're not jealous of me? I see. Jealous. You are now jealous because I am part of the royal family as the princess and queen of this land to be. Get out! Amara! Are you out of your senses? I am not, obviously. You are asking me out of this palace? I've already asked you. No, in, in short, you are walking me out? I just did it. Hi. She just be going. Be going first. It's alright. We shall see. We have already seen. Since I'm going to give you advice. Michi, you mean I'm going to talk to you in that manner? Just because you advised her. Agnes, there is no abusive word in the dictionary that that girl didn't use on me. Yes. Can you imagine the most painful thing is that she said I am jealous of her simply because she's not reality and that she's the, the, the future queen. Can you imagine that? How? I'm a little rat of yesterday. It's all right. I'm going to say that for you. <laughs> Hey, wait, has she forgotten how this whole thing started? Oh, Amara has forgotten that you are the one that took her to the palace in the first place. Ichie, I can see that that girl wants to kill you. Oh yes, she wants to kill you. She wants to kill you. 
Look, you better call her to order. You better warn her to desist from this nonsense. If not, she will not like the consequences of this her action. Uh, Ichi, I will do that. Please, I'm sorry. You better do. Uh, you better do. Uh, <laughs> it's my, right. my dear, please. It's not time for that. It's not time for that. It's all right. We shall see. You are welcome once again. Thank you. You're welcome. My son. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Mom. Uh, might as well care for. Uh, to be frank with you, uh, what you are asking for is not possible. Uh, the reason is that I don't want my last daughter, Judith, to get married before my first daughter, Onine. We are all in this village. And we are aware that a lot of suitors have come to marry Onine and she rejected all of them. And I don't want my son to go through that trauma of rejection. I was the person that suggested she, he should marry Judith, your younger daughter. That she's a good girl. Why are you making it impossible for us? Well, uh, Mazo Kafo, thank you for the compliment that my last daughter Judith is a good girl. That's why you came for her. Uh, but uh, you see... But what, Papa? You see what, Papa? What have I done to you? I, I was inside and over. I had everything you were telling them. Papa, let me ask you. Am I the one that asked you to reject our suitors? Why was it affect my own marriage? Papa, I don't like it though. I don't like it. Though. You do to get inside. Papa, I'm not going anywhere. I said get inside. I'm not going anywhere. This guy came here for me and I will marry you. Whether, whether, whether you like it or not. Hey, you will marry him. Whether I like it or not. Uh, Papa, okay? Judith, okay. please. I she do not it. want you to say anything anymore. Just keep quiet. That's your problem. Your mouth run too fast. Is that how you would talk to your father in presence of your, your father in law and your, and your husband to be? Eh? I'm sorry, sister. Uh -uh. I don't want you to say a word. Okay? Papa, Papa, please be calm. Forgive her. She's only but a child. Eh? I, I, I know she doesn't mean to disrespect you like this. You know, you know, Judy, she doesn't know how to present her case. But then again, Judith is right. Um, I'm not saying, no, Papa, I'm not saying she's right to have insulted you, to have disrespected you, no, no, no. But she's right because these people came to marry her, not me. Okay, so just give them your blessings. Besides, I, I am no longer available. I'm no longer available, yes. Um... Uh, Welcome, our in-laws. Welcome. Um, please, sir, what is your name? Um, my name is Kelechi. Okay. Um, Mr. Kelechi, you're welcome. Thank you. Please, do you truly love my sister? Um, yes, of course, I do. Okay. That's good. Judith. Yes, sister. Are you saying you love Kelechi well enough? To want to spend the rest of your life with him? Yes, sister. I like you. In fact, I love you and I want to marry you. Ah. That's that's that settles it. I mean, what? That's it. Um, Papa, this settles everything. I don't think there's any reason for us to <laughs> to be having fights, quarrels. Welcome, welcome, sirs. Welcome. She loves him. He loves her. That's all that matters. But of course, you get inside. I say both of you leave this place now. Papa, I'll marry you. Get inside. I'll marry you. Be quiet. I'll marry you. Papa, just ignore her. She's just a child. Ignore her. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Papa, this matter is settled now. It's not. In, it's not. In, I'm, I'm. I'm. no longer available. Be there what I said. I said follow her. My dear, be there. Your daughter love my son. Well, it's good for us to be in love, though. Uh, we used to be good friends. Uh, she's not good. 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 See, Mama, I don't like what Papa did, though. 
So if I'm sister in didn't come out to me in that fair, I would have just lose this Samsung guy. I would have just killed myself. What did she say? <laughs> <laughs> you should have killed yourself now. It's because everything has worked out. Very soon I'll be addressed as Mrs. Judith Kelechi Okafo. Oh, oh wow. wow. <laughs> Mama, this guy is very stupid. So you would have killed yourself because of a man, mm -hmm. right? So you have to just calm down and take things easy. Because if you sharp mouth more than this, I'll just go out there and present myself to them to marry. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. Right, shine. Hey. 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 And where is that food? Hey. Julie! Yeah. Julie, you have grown ways that you can talk and insult me before my in-laws. Eh? Are you mad? Papa, I'm sorry, just that the truth needs to be told. Truth? Which truth? Which person are you talking about? Talk about you talking about your is? I'm a man. Nah. <clears throat> now they are your in-laws. What did he just call them? He said his in-laws. <laughs> hey, nah. If not that my precious daughter, Onine, eh, interfered and they, they left, would you have been calling them your in-law? And what kind of Moses person you. is that? Eh? Oh, no, eh? oh, what kind of Moses person is that? Your in-laws. Judith. Judith. Papa. Judith. Uh -uh. Your sweet daughter. If your mouth wants to be sharp, please go close to your father. Mm. Don't you go my mother and be running out like see a tap. See me, see what I uh -uh. Eh? Now what for you? Papa, just relax, eh? Take it easy. Mm. Uh -uh, it's Judith, oh. Mm -hmm. It's Judith. <coughs> Mama, you know she's a very small girl. Besides, she's a sweetheart. Mm. Small girl? Which one is a small girl? This one? Uh -uh. This one is a small girl? Your darling, she's a small girl. Yeah. By the way, where are you? Papa. What was the meaning of that thing that you said before my in-laws? Uh -uh. <laughs> that uh, you are no longer available. What was the meaning of that? Oh, I'm not that wrong. Yeah, I want you to have my happy one here. Oh, I'm asking you. Papa, eh? Is it here? You said. What was the meaning of that, that, that you just said? That you're not going to have a little. Okay, that she's getting by. <laughs> so, to uh, his in laws. Yeah, yeah, Amara. What has come over you? Why must you talk to Ichie like that? Just because he advised you for your own good. Are you mad? Have you forgotten that any position you are in? It's Ichie that placed you there. Let me warn you. If you dare lose that opportunity of being in that palace, this compound will not accommodate you and I. Oh, that's your plan. To bring me back to this, this wretched house. To stay with you? That's not possible, no, mama. Or not possible. So Ichie came here. I'm not I made me your topic, as in your gossip topic. Hey, Mama? Listen. Stay away from my home. I mean, my marriage. As you can see, class say change you go. I am not in the same class again. You can stay in your husband's house for all I care. As for Ichie, I know how to do. It's just too little for me to handle. Let's go. It is again the one in the house. In this palace, everyone in the house. Cause if you do any other, they go show you the door. It is a disappointing delay. You are so lucky I met you here, Jay. I was just on my way to your house to warn your wife and you. I wanted to ask you why you went to my house to discuss me with my mother. To gossip me, Che. Huh? I have seen you have nothing useful to do with this. This is your miserable life. Amara, are you by any means talking to me? Mm-mm. Check around. What was someone here? No. Are you insane? Am I the one you are screaming on like this? Who are you? Okay, who are you? Huh. Huh? I have warned you to stay away from my royal home. Come on. 
Is it because God used you to introduce me to the royal home? Something I know that Jesus took to the table and God signed it. Jesus. Ordained in heaven that I shall be the queen of this land. So because of that, I should be under your control. Oh yeah? Eh? And you see this show, this your dry lips. You use in telling me that I'm insane. One day I will remind you of it. When I must have married the prince, then you will know the gravity of what you just said. I could look at every prostitute. Let's go. This is the last one. It is again the one in the heart. In this balance, the one in the heart. Because if you do any heart, it will show you the door. It is a disappointing delay. You are lying. You brought me into this room for the past 20 minutes and you have not said anything. What is it? Nay. It's just that I want to tell you. Oddly proposed to Onine Chuko. And Onine have accepted to marry him. Which Oddly and the year you are talking about. Oh. Adele, your tenant. Onye Chuku, your daughter. Both of them are mad. It will never happen in my house. They are mad. Now I calm down. Eh? You have to calm down. Let's look for a solution. Like I said, Onye Chuku have accepted to marry him. You have accepted to marry him, and you say that she will come down. You are mad. Do you hear me? You are mad. Can I say why? So this is the reason they make it rejecting all the responsible women that came to do for her the marriage and they supported her. That was her charmed boot of you. But it's not what I got my marriage. I got my marriage. I got my marriage. I got my marriage. please. Let's see how to sort these things out. Avoid making mistakes. Please. There's nothing to sort out. There's nothing to sort out, woman. I said this before that this girl has a mission in this house. But I didn't know that it has gotten to the extent of charming my daughter and my wife. Omanme. Hmm. Omanme. Charming me. Nay. No one is charming anybody here. The children just fell in love. Eh? They fell in love. Why you did I give you the Jiran? Maki Bonina Ude Jiran. That boy in order, what a good kitchen. I don't know what to do. First it more money. He's leaving my house. What am I going to do? Onine. She have accepted to marry this boy without letting me know. Eh? Nai seems to understand what any other person is saying apart from his own. Hey! Any wanted tenant in my house will go to fire. I am on you. Good morning, sir. 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 But, sir, what have I done this early morning? Don't ask me what you have done, but what have you not done? Bia, 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 bia. Orderly, so this is how you are. Hey! I'm living with a normal human being. But that I'm, that I'm living with a little doctor who does nothing that going about charming uh, uh, other people's daughter. Ha. I don't want to tell that to my family. Please, Papa, please. Nobody has charmed anybody. Nobody charmed anybody, yo. Please, I know what I am doing. 
it is all over you. And you have already told me that he charmed you because you are not the one talking. You are talking for what he planted into you. But don't worry, my daughter. The last. Nage, it's the Mike. Agamelo Rogwa. Papa, that's a very strong word to use. I am not under any form of spell. I am in love with Odili. Yeah. Yes. You're and I have I am in love. And I have accepted to marry him. This is me only talking. I am talking out of love, not charm. You are in love. Yes, Papa. You love this thing. You are in love. This thing. <laughs> now let me ask you. This thing you said you are in love. What does he have? His name is Who is he? Odili. What is his surname? Yeah? Somebody who cannot pay two thousand naira his house rent. He is standing before me, proudly telling me, Hey, Papa, I love him. What is his surname? I am asking you, what is his surname? Yeah. But, but, why, why am I even talking? Yeah? Audrey, go in there. Pick your bag, because I know that is the only thing you have. That's the only thing you came with. Pick your bag. Because we are leaving my house this moment. <laughs> Papa, that one will not even pay you. See this road now, this road you are traveling on, it will not pay you. It will not pay anybody because at the end of the day, you'll be on the receiving end. Papa, you'll be the one to lose, oh. Because if this man leaves this compound, I only need, I am going with him. What did I hear you say? Papa, you heard me. If he leaves, I will leave. If we leave, you are you are living with him. Yes, Papa. Nai. Nai, calm down. Nai, Jirikwane Awayo. Jirikwani Awayo, what did the orderly do to you that makes you to ask him to pack out of our house because he is in love with oh, your daughter? Eh? you want to marry me? How can you want to marry me? Eh? Chama, mama, you came to marry me. Jirikwani Awayo. There are something. He. Something. I want you to call home now, 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 if you still want to meet your mother and Donine alive. Because I am going to kill them now, here. Huh? Yeah. Eh? You traveled. Oh. Oh. When are you coming back? Eh? Okay, I should come down. I should come down. Okay, okay, it's alright. Papa, cool you down. Cool you no, down. Uh-uh. No. I have to calm down, relax. Mama, did Papa not marry you? Did he charm you? Ask him. I don't know. I don't know whether he charmed me. Because I charmed the charm. Eh? So, you people are not talking back at me. <clears throat> you have got to sit before me and talk back at me. Okay? Okay? Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not, nah. you, are you still here? Oh, are you still here? Hey. Where are you going? Papa, when did I expect you to come to my father? Where is our marina and go? You see, I answer me. I'm not going to marry you. 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 You see the name of my What is it? You look troubled. Is it because of what my husband told you this morning? But Mama, why? Why is he treating me like this? Is it because I'm poor? Or I'm from a poor background. He kept reminding me how poor I am. <sighs> Mama, how, how, how can he be treating me like this? I haven't done anything wrong. I told him I was going to p pay the rent. He should just give me some time. All he does is castigate me, call me all sorts of names. He even said I used charm on his daughter. How can he say a thing like that? Is it because of my condition, my predicament? 
Mama, is it a crime? Is it a crime to love somebody with all my heart? Why is he treating me like this? No, my son. It's not a crime. Mm -hmm. I know you have true love for my daughter. And my daughter loves you too. It's not all about money. See, since both of you love each other, I 